There we go. Uh, hello? Aunt Manti? Hello? You're on stream. Yeah. Yeah, so we're getting uh, we're getting started here. I'm just like making the social media posts and uh, yeah, we're going to be playing Metal Gear Solid. I've really been looking forward to starting this. I'm sorry it's been delayed like God, like two, three weeks by this point. But like, I, I hope y'all are uh, ready to like have a good time. Dabs. Yeah, just making the social media posts, you know, doing the whole thing. <laughs> what, you saw my tweet? No, I saw your title again. God. Yeah, uh... Literally, my tweet. Going live with part one of Metal Gear Solid. Kept you waiting, huh? Because <laughs> I kept fucking delaying this stream. <laughs> Can you delete that message in VC text, by the way? <laughs> yeah, sure. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> fucking hell. So what it is. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Ah... Uh... Just making sure that, like, everything's dialed incorrectly. And, let's see here. Okay, yeah, the OSSC capture is working correctly. Let me just double check. Yep, monitor off. Okay. Ah! Uh, got a follow from Bnui32. Oh, hello. Hello. That's the person I was telling you about earlier. Yeah, and, uh, Minty redeemed a beep boop. Welcome to Squid Stream. W welcome, this welcome. friend. Actually, I need to go shut my bedroom door, so I will take one second. Y'all just, like, watch the intro, I guess. <laughs> The nuclear weapons disposal facility on Shadow Moses Island in Alaska's Fox Archipelago was attacked and All captured right. by next generation special forces. Being led Check by my stream announcement Fox channel. They're demanding that the government turn over the remains of Big Boss. <laughs> damn, damn it, Evie. Not met within 24 hours. They'll launch a nuclear weapon. Yeah. Uh... Actually, oh, I accidentally killed the cutscene. I want to let that play out, so I'll let it start again. Because, like, that's actually plot relevant. Uh, Y'all are actually going to be getting a better experience than me. Because I actually don't have the CRT filter on my monitor. That's only on the stream. So, like, y'all fucking enjoy that. That was a lot of work to get working and get looking right. But I really like the effect that it gives. You're a nerd.
Yeah, actually, uh, I'm probably going to be making a tutorial on how to do that CRT filter on original hardware because this is actually like being captured off of a PS1, but then I'm doing all sorts of crazy stuff to apply an emulator or CRT filter over it. Like, I think that's something that like more people should like try to do. And like, yeah, it's something that makes my stuff different, but I think it would be cool if more people did that. So I am probably going to make like a whole tutorial on how to do it. So, uh, Evie, uh, Riv, uh, how y'all doing? Riv, it's actually been a while since I've seen you in here. Like, how are you doing? Disposal facility on Shadow Moses Island in Alaska's Fox Archipelago was attacked and captured by Next Generation Special Forces, being led by members of Foxhound. They're demanding that the government turn over the remains of Big Boss. And they say that if they're demanding yeah, that's understandable, Riv. I've just been, I've actually been wondering, like, where you've been, because, like, it's been so long. You'll have two mission objectives. First, you're to rescue DARPA Chief Donald Anderson and the president of Arms Tech, Kenneth Baker. Both are being held as You know, like, I, I, I care about my viewers. I care about the people that, like, come in here, you know? Y'all are, y'all are cool. Y'all are cool. So, like... I noticed that you hadn't been in, and I was just, like, wondering what was up. Like, li life shit's life shit. Like, that's understandable. Like, I'm glad everything's alright. And then, we'll launch a one-man SDV. After the SDV gets as close as it can, dispose of it. From there on, you'll have to... Oh, I need to change my category. I yeah. I got it. Yo, Duper. Special Forces Your own stream. Foxhound, your former unit, and one that I was a Duper's in the call? <laughs> oh, Duper's muted. Nice. There are six members of Foxhound involved in this terrorist activity. Psycho Mattis, with his powerful psychic abilities. Sniper Wolf. Hopefully they remember the own stream. Deadly yeah. Shot shooter. Decoy Octopus. It would be funny Master to have a repeat the last time. <laughs> yeah, that was funny. I'm streaming, like, Pokemon Mystery Dungeon, and Duper's just like, fucking like, wait, you're streaming? Specialist in interrogation, and a formidable gunfighter, and finally... Oh, that's cool. MGBA, the emulator, has got connectivity with Dolphin. Nice. The man with the same code name as you. I'm guessing uh, that might be uh, how uh, Orange was doing uh, Four Swords Adventures on stream. I mean, you don't need the GBA for that. Infiltration mission. Weapons and equipment OSP. They literally had the GBAs visible on the stream next to the GameCube input. Yeah, I know, but you can play without the GBA. No, I I know, but when Orange streamed Four Swords Adventures, you could see both the GameCube and the GBA on the stream, so they were using GBA. Huh. A tweet is some 19 hours ago. What tweet? A tweet about... That? Okay, well, I was just saying I wonder if that's how they did it. I don't know. Hmm. Oh, look. God. I, I didn't realize I was on mute. Nice. We told you. We, we literally said you're muted. I was also getting my headphones. Ah. Also, Sorry. you're on stream. <laughs> oh. Yes. Oh. Hi. We're telling you right away this time. Yeah. Oh, no. Yeah, I, uh, I'm starting Metal Gear Solid. Kept you waiting, huh? Is it solid? I mean... Does I, it have gears? I mean, it's a Kojima game, so, like, I'm solid. Does it have gears? You're just not acknowledging my joke. Does it, does it have metal? Is it made out of metal? It's it's metal, it's a gear, and I am solid. Yeah, you're a robot. I didn't expect you to be solid. Beep boop. <laughs> Beep boop. Stay alert. If you be through here, I know it. I'm going to swat down a couple of bombers and flies.
so got pretty boy over there like just like yeah, fucking like, i know who that is but like legit it's just the first time we see that character it's just like fucking random this is antagonistic Colonel british Peter. pretty boy Loud and clear. What's the situation? i thought you were talking like about me for a second is the only way up just as i expected you'll have to take the elevator to the surface but make sure nobody sees you if you need to contact me by codec the frequency is 140.85 oh great oh, i forgot about that? the i forgot about the frequencies i'm gonna need to like actually dig out my like case for this game at some point because it's like oh you need to get the this codec thing off of, like the back of the game case because like that was like their way of like anti-piracy was like putting an essential component for the game on just the box art <laughs> wow Uh, who, who's good? Oh, yeah, uh, Evie, uh, I mean, Duper, uh, Evie was asking if you're, uh, you're good, because, like, you don't sound, like, they said you don't sound so great. <laughs> oh, yeah, I'm getting over being sick. Oof. Oh, I hope yeah, I've, you're... I have no idea why. Yeah, yeah, I hope you're good. Uh, I'm alright. I took a nap. I'm kind of laughing like the rabbit hole I've gone down sort of by like, by like, oh, push select. Okay. Game's like, game decides to interrupt me while I'm talking there. <laughs> okay. Thanks. Oh, no. You better hide somewhere. Yeah. Like, I just on a whim, I found out that the like sound when you first turn the game on is a sample from the theme for Police Knots. And now I'm just going on this like rabbit hole about like wanting to play Police Knots. Psychonauts. No. Metal Gear Knots. Uh, basically, uh, Kojima made a bunch of different games before, uh, like Metal Gear Solid really took off, and uh, one of them was a uh, was this uh, sort of visual novel, like cyberpunk noir thing called, uh, Police Knots. I didn't even know about that. And I call myself a gamer? Yeah, uh, if you've heard of Snatcher, uh, Snatcher is another game that he worked on that's really, like, sort of similar to that. For a moment there, I thought you meant Snatcher from Hat in Time. No. That's a good game, though. But, but yeah, like, a friend of mine is, like, gonna, like, help me get, like, the stuff I need to, like, get, like, a Sega Saturn and, like, to play, like, the fan translation for Police Knots, because, like, the Saturn version is, like, the definitive version. And, like, like, I'm just, like, getting super jazzed up for that, honestly. And it's all just because I was, like, someone just offhand was, like, oh, yeah, the sound when you first turn Metal Gear Solid on is just, like, a sample from the intro theme to Police Knots. God, this intro, like, you're, like, playing the intro credits. That's, like, kind of trippy. Like, for a game that came out, like, on the PS1, like, that's... 
But, like, I get it. It's Kojima. Kojima's all about, like, cinematic shit. Like, he studied film as a kid. And so, like, the idea of, like, having an interactive title sequence, it's all, like, cinematic. And, like, like that that makes sense for his style of stuff. It's just, like, for a game that came out this early, bless you, this early, it's sort of like, well, damn, that's different. Of the disposal facility. Excellent, Snake. Age hasn't slowed you down one bit. How's that sneaking suit working out? I'm nice and dry, but it's a little hard to move. Bear with it. It's designed to prevent hypothermia. This is Alaska, you know. Take it easy. I'm grateful. If it weren't for your suit and your shot, I would have turned into a popsicle out there. An anti-freezing peptide, Snake. All of the genome soldiers in this exercise are using it. I see. I'm relieved to hear that. Already tested, huh? By the way, how's the diversionary operation going? Evie is on a whole Defense other level. Just took off from Galena and are headed your way. The terrorist radar should have already. Been yeah, that that is some shit. Fucking just yo-yo tricks and like, th that's a power move right there. Yeah. Oh, I actually don't. I actually have a yo-yo too. -yo What's a Russian gunship doing here? I just I know how no to do idea. the walk the dog trick, but, but my yo-yo just like kind of broken though. I can do the break the window. <laughs> it's my best trick. I usually finish with that one. God, the rumble on the PS1 controller feels so good. Like, I can feel, like, the pulsing from the, like, helicopter blades. Like, it's not just, like, one level of rumble. It's actually going, like, like, and it's, like, going up and down and up and, like, and, like, like, holy shit. This was, like, the first controller to really do rumble, and they still, like, they fucking nailed it. Wow, you must be crazy to fly behind in this kind of weather. Who's that? Oh, sorry. I haven't introduced you two yet. This is Mei Ling. She was assigned to us as our visual and data processing specialist. She designed your codec, as well as your Soliton radar system. Contact her if you have any questions about either of them. <laughs> nice to meet you, Snake. It's an honor to speak to a, a living legend like yourself. What's wrong? Nothing. I just didn't expect a world-class designer of military technology to be so... cute. <laughs> You're just flattering me. No, I'm serious. Well, I know I won't be bored for the next 18 hours. Come on. I can't believe I'm being hit on by the famous Solid Snake. But uh, I'm surprised. You're very frank for a train killer. Looks like we both have a lot to learn about each other. Yeah. I'm looking forward to learning about the man behind the legend. But first, let me explain about your Soliton radar system. The bright dot in the middle is you, Snake. I think I'm gonna yeah. go over to Squid's house and steal and their Picari sweat. I already drank it. Okay, never mind that I won't. The genome soldiers have highly developed senses of hearing and vision due to their gene therapy. Make yeah, like I told you, I was like feeling really sick last night at one point during VR chat. I just ran into the kitchen and like shotgun the whole bottle. Was injected with the same GPS transmitting nanomachines as you. You like stabbed the bottom of it and just cracked open the top of it and just <laughs> No, I just, I just like I, I just opened it up because it was already like I'd already opened it previously. I just opened it up and I just like bam, just shotgun the whole thing. Is that what you were doing when you were on the floor in VR chat? No, no. Th I just got some, like, Japanese snacks and was just, like, fucking just eating Japanese snacks. It's all made from currently existing technology. So, everybody knows in, uh, in chat, yesterday we were all in VR chat, and Squid was on all fours, munching away <laughs> on snacks. <laughs> yeah, I mean, Voxid was like, hey, you want to go to Shibuya? And I'm like, sure. And then, like, I'm, we're, like, going around, I'm like, man, this is, like, making me miss, like, being in Japan. And so I'm like, fuck, I have some Japanese snacks. I'm gonna just, like, BRB. And so I got a bunch of Japanese snacks, and we were hanging out. I'm just, like, eating, like, fucking... Fucking Umaibo and uh, Kinokonoyama. No, I had Takenokonosato, not Kinokonoyama. But like, I was just like having like Japanese garbage food, and everyone was like, "What the fuck are you doing?" Dr. Naomi 
here, and then all my weapons are taken away. <laughs> it was pretty Imagine funny. Yourself put in that position. Well, if you Mincy was dead piece, the whole time. <laughs> yeah. And then y'all were just making <laughs> jokes about, like, because, like, B was, like, hunched over next to me, and, like, one of you was, like, joke that I was <laughs> eating peace. Thanks to the shot you gave me that suppressed my stomach acids. Cigarettes? How are those going to help you? It was a good time. <laughs> yeah, it was, it was good. It was good. If you want to get in, there's the front door. It's the fastest way, but there's too much risk of being spotted by the enemy. I can't just knock on the door and ask them to let me in. Uh, there's one sentry on the left and one on the right. They're armed with five five sixers and pineapples. If I recall correctly, there's a truck somewhere around here with a gun, which would be useful. What about yep. the air duct near the door? I haven't played this game in like floor. literally a decade and I never actually beat it. So like that's one reason I'm excited to get to this. I can't see it from here. I'll let you decide the best COA. I'm counting on you, Snake. Yep, there we go. Okay. Yep. Nice. Oh, oh, shit, 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 shit. Is there anybody else again? Fucking Eevee here giving yo yo tips in my chat. Probably gonna run to the liquor store in a little bit here. Right. Get more coffee. I'll just mute myself. I literally like live a block away from a liquor store. A surveillance camera? It's been ages since, like, just, god, I miss this game. Like, it's just, god, the PS1 had so many good games. Like, Croc! around there somewhere. They must need a lot of power to run the base. There's probably a diesel generator somewhere. And since generating electricity requires oxygen, there must be exhaust openings for that, too. You're not gonna believe this. But they shot down the F-16s we were using as a diversion with a Hein D. Then we got a message from Liquid. He said if we try something like that again, he'll launch the nuke. Snake, hurry up and get in there. That Hein will be coming back soon. A lot of fucking Kodak calls. Snake, this is McDonald Miller. It's been a long time. Master, what are you doing here? I quit being a drill instructor, so I moved out here for some peace and quiet. I'm in retirement, just like you. Once in a while, I still All right, help I'm gonna be right back. All right, I'm not even gonna jump off the call. Yeah, nice. Woo! <laughs> Campbell told
told me about the situation here. I thought I might be of some use. There's no one I'd rather have in a foxhole than you. Well, I know lots about survival in a harsh environment. I've lived in Alaska longer than you. So call me if you have any questions about the flora or fauna out here. My frequency is 141.80. You're just introducing all the like supporting characters being like, here's the Kodak for this person, here's the Kodak for that person. Fucking just It's kinda jarring to go straight from like the really cinematic intro to just procedural stuff about establishing the the world. What about the vent shaft cleaning? They just opened the vent covers. About to start spraying for rats. First floor basement ventilation shaft. Shut those covers as soon as they're done spraying. Also, keep your eye on that woman in the cell. Don't get careless now. Woman in the cell? D Duper literally just left Evie. Impossible, huh? Press the action button to drop down. Okay. Before I do that, I'm, uh... I'ma just get that. Game's like, press the action button. I'm like, no, I see an item. Evie, please. Use the elevator to change floors. There should be a cargo elevator that you can take down somewhere around there. Try to find it. Open door. Oh, I guess it's locked. That's fine. fine. Okay. Enjoy the jelly beans, I guess. Like, are they any, like, particular flavor, or, like, what? Je jelly beans, good. The, the prank ones are a thing. Wait. 
Let's hear. Oh, I thought that was like an entry. Okay. Shit! I wasn't against the wall. Shit, 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 shit. Shit, shit. Oh, no. Uh, yeah, I'm dead. Okay. Immediate fuck up. That's fine. Do I need to get those items again? I'm assuming I didn't. Yeah, I do. Okay. That's fine. No, I don't I don't need to hear this again. Okay, so that's... okay. I'm back. Welcome back. How long did that take? Uh, not very long, but Evie was convinced you took two hours. What? Yeah, you left you have... What? You haven't been streaming for two hours. I know, Evie was like... As soon as you left, EB was like, how long has it been? It feels like it's been two hours since Duper left. Aww. I hope that's because they enjoy my company. I assume so. Duper missed you. <laughs> I missed you too. What is Mincy doing? I don't know. How do I check that? Mitzi be vibing. yourself a weapon. To use it, first hold down the R2 button to enter weapon mode. Then select the weapon you want with the directional button. I like eating nerds candy because I'm secretly hungry for aquarium gravel and this takes the edge off. What? What? I'm trying to remember if, like, how to pull up the, like, list of, like, saved codecs, or if I, like, actually need to be writing these down, because I thought there was a list of, like, saved codecs, but, like, I don't remember. Fucking hell. There we go. Okay, it was down. Okay. You uh. found out where the DARPA chief is. With his nanomachine transmitter, he should show up as a green dot on your radar when you get close. Try to find him. Okay, Mei Ling, I just wanted to save. <laughs> just eat aquarium gravel, you coward. That is the second time I've been called a coward today. Come on, Snake, you can do it. I mean, you being you, I, I don't think a coward would be able to pull off being you. I am pretty weird. <laughs> Yeah, that that was the joke. Ah, I missed City Escape from my playlist. Well, oh, gotta start that over. Nice. I had my music going while I was gone. Oh yeah. Good shit. What? What? Oh! 
Emery, uh, <laughs> Emery, thank you for the raid. Oh shit, I I whiffed my controls there because I was looking down and I my D-pad fucked up. Great. So y'all are gonna immediately just see me die. Wonderful. That's good. Uh, let me see if I can just like up. Oh, yeah, there's a guy there. Uh, there's a guy there. There's fucking shit, shit. Yep. We want to see a robot squid die. Yep. Yep. No, I'm I'm dead. They're they're, they're coming after. Me. Okay. No, I'm not dead. Surprisingly. Let's see here. Let me just. How do I get my inventory? No. Trying to, trying to remember how to like actually use the thing I just equipped. I got it. I got I got it, DB. <laughs> oh please. <laughs> hey. I'd already did that for, for There's me. Minty! There's Minty. Yeah, I duper like I'm always gonna shout you out, BB. I'm always don't. gonna shout you out. You don't have hey, to do uh, that. It's Emery's birthday. Yeah, and I also wanted to shout out Emery, because Emery fucking raided me, and I'm like, fucking good shit. I already shouted them out. You did? Well, yeah. I didn't see it. Well, I'm gonna do yeah. it again. I'm gonna do it again. Yeah. Okay. Okay. <laughs> okay. So, uh, the raid went to them from Mincy, and now back to you. Yeah. And, uh, Emery was, like, doing some sick shit on a guitar. Can they do a kickflip with it? Now I just want to see someone convert a guitar into a skateboard. Well, well Mincy! I feel like that's been done. Trying to figure out how to use one of these rations, and it's like actually driving me crazy. Like, I don't... Oh, of course it's Bryce's skateboard. There we go, okay. There we go. Okay. You can check VTX. Okay. Oh. Oh wow. It turns the leaf. Uh oh. There we go. There's the cargo elevator. And like, up, oh, someone's coming. Ah, shit. Okay. Go away, go away, go away, go away, go away, go away. Cookie clack ASMR. Please don't. Please don't turn to the right. Please don't turn to the right. Okay, good. Turn to the left. There we go. Oh, there's the... Yeah. There you go. Uh, I will be right back. I gotta configure LIV nice. for my stream later. Nice. I'll be back. Okay. Look at the radar. It's picking up the DARPA chief. He's the green dot. Hurry and rescue him. Let's get it. Skating a bass guitar, good lord. I was joking, but like, okay, I guess that exists.
Yeah, uh, yeah, Liv is, uh, I think that's, like, fitness stuff for VR. Making guitars out of skateboards. Fucking... Okay, that's... That sounds less insane, and now I actually want to, like, see that. Here's what that looks like. I, uh, I haven't looked at... I haven't been looking at Discord. Uh, that's just, just for chat. Okay. I'm gonna... Yeah. Oh, damn. Oh, damn. That looks rad, actually. Snake, the DARPA chief signal is coming from somewhere in that area. Isn't there some place to drop down? Take a look around in first-person view mode. Okay. First person. Uh, uh, Eduardo M. Uh, 0016, thank you for the uh, follow. Donald Anderson, right? You here to save me, huh? What's your outfit? I'm the pawn they sent here to save your worthless butt. Really? It's true. You don't look like one of them. In that case, hurry up and get me out of here. Slow down. Don't worry. First, I want some information about the terrorists. The terrorists? Do they really have the ability to launch a nuke? What are you talking about? The terrorists are threatening the White House. They say if they don't accede to their demands, they'll launch a nuclear weapon. Sweet Jesus. Is it possible? It's possible. They could launch a nuke. Uh, what? How did they plan to launch? I thought this place was just for keeping the dismantled warheads. They shouldn't have access to a missile. What I'm about to tell you is classified information. Okay? We're conducting exercises with a new type of experimental weapon. A weapon that will change the world. What? A weapon with the ability to launch a nuclear attack from any place on the face of the Earth. A nuclear-equipped walking battle tank. Metal Gear. They're like, actually, that the... Metal Gear. Yep. <laughs> it can't be. You knew? Metal Gear is one of the most secret black projects. How did you know that? We've had a couple of run-ins in the past. So that's the reason you were here at this disposal site? Why else would I come to a godforsaken place like this? I had heard the Metal Gear project was scrapped. On the contrary. It's grown into a huge joint project between ArmsTech and ourselves. We were going to use this exercise as raw data and then proceed to mass production. The fucking load time when the FMVs cut in and out. Hadn't been for the revolution. This revolution? Rex has fallen into the hands of terrorists. Rex? Metal Gear Rex. The code name for the new Metal Gear prototype. They probably already finished arming the warhead they plan to use with Rex. These guys are pros. They're all experienced in handling and equipping weapons. Hey! Shut up in there, will ya? Oh, they didn't realize that it's a conversation. I will, don't. I have no idea. Measures, some kind of detonation code that you have to input. Oh, you mean PAL? Yes, of course. There is a PAL. 
It's set up so that you need to input two different passwords in order to launch the device. There are two passwords? Yes. Baker knows one, and I know one. Baker? The president of arms tech. That's right. Each of us needs to input our password, or there can be no launch. But... They found out my password. You talked? Psychomantis can read people's minds. You can't resist. Psychomantis? One of the members of Foxhound. He has psychic powers. This is bad. It's just a matter of time before the end. Oh, uh, Voxid, thank you for the uh, follow. Uh, welcome to the stream. Password. I just sort of vibe into a cutscene here. You'll be able to launch a nuke anytime. There is a way to stop the launch. What? The card keys. Card keys? They were designed by Armstead, the system developers, as an emergency override. Even without the passwords, you can just insert the card keys and engage the safety lock. And if I do that? Yes. You can stop the launch. That card key? So where are the keys? Baker should have them. Listen. You need three card keys. There are three different slots to put them in. You need to insert a card into each one of them. Okay, three card keys. Do you know where they might be keeping Baker? Somewhere in the second floor basement. Second floor basement? I heard the guards say they moved him to an area that has a lot of electronic jamming. Any other clues? Yes, they cemented over the entrances but didn't have enough time to paint them. Why don't you look for the areas where the walls are a different color? Here, take this. It's my ID card. It'll open any level one security door. It's called a pan card. It works together with your body's own electrical field. Personal area network, huh? It transmits data using the salts in your body as the transmission medium. As you approach the door's security devices, they'll read the data stored in the card. And the doors will open automatically. Gotcha. Okay. I, I love how, like, this game, like, does the same sort of thing that, like, uh, Splinter Cell did, where, uh, like, they're adapting, like, ideas for possible military technology into, like, a feasible future military narrative. So does the White House plan to give in to the terrorist demands? That's their problem. It has nothing to do with my orders. But what about the Pentagon? The Pentagon? What is it? What's that? Hey, what happened? Uh oh, spaghettios. to understand this op is security level red you need the highest security clearance to get access to the complete file you want me to believe that you're in charge of this op but you don't have complete access to the file i told you the secretary of defense is in operational control i'm just here as your support snake we don't have time to debate get out of there and find president baker something's fucky something's fucky Dude just fucking drops dead, and they're like, oh, we're not hiding anything. How do I get out of... I'm trying to... How do I... Oh. Un okay.
Do I, like, go back up into the vent, or, like, what? Shit. Oh, someone unlocked the door. I'm stupid. Don't move. So you killed the chief, you bastard. Liquid? No, you're not. Don't move! Is this the first time you ever pointed a gun at a person? Your hands are shaking. <sighs> Can you shoot me, rookie? Careful. I'm no rookie. Liar. That nervous glance. That scared look in your eyes. They're rookie's eyes if I ever saw them. You've never shot a person, am I right? You talk too much. You haven't even taken the safety off, rookie. I told you I'm no rookie! You're not one of them, are you? Open that door. You've got a card, don't you? Why? So we can get the hell out of here. Looks like we'll be a little delayed. What are you doing? Don't think. Shoot! Yeah. Alright. Shit. I, I don't know how the gun works. Game just like throws me in with no tutorial other than how to equip a gun. Hopefully that didn't kick me back too far. If it did, I'm gonna have to like... Okay, good. It only kicked me back to here. So... She's gonna unlock the door. Oh, that's what the noise is, her knocking the guy out and changing into his outfit. Let me see if I can figure out how to fire this gun in the meantime. Okay, got it. Are you going to open the door? Okay, there we go. Okay, there we go. It just... Okay. And nope, nope, that. Okay, so what am I supposed to. Okay, so. God. How to aim when you have D pad controls and that's it is a little rough. I gotta wait that out again. Okay. Maybe if I just, like, punch him. It's like, I know I can do that. Okay, come on. Open the door. Let's try that from the top. And that didn't work either. Well. We may be here a little while, folks. We may be here a little while, but... Oh, it, it, it'll work out. It'll work out. Just... Hmm... I hate how, like, I have to wait for her to unlock the door every time, though. That's kind of butts. Oh, shit. No, get up. There we go. Okay, I I got you. Use the weapon. Okay. There we go. What are you waiting for? Shoot! Don't talk to 
me like a rookie? I'm telling you, shoot! Uh, hey, hey, my girl. Welcome, welcome. Oh, shit. Okay. Thanks for the help. Wait. Who are you? You fool. You've killed him. I'm sorry, sir. His mental shielding was very strong. I could not dive into his mind. Now we'll never get that detonation code. Boss, I have a good idea. Uh oh, SpaghettiOs? Yep, uh, uh oh, spaghettios. Naomi, I just had some kind of hallucination. Is it from the nano machines? No, Snake. The nano machines are functioning properly. So, what was it? It must have been psychometric interference coming from Psychomantis, Foxhound Psychic. Think of it as a mental feedback loop. So, that was Mantis. Is there anything else around? Nope, the card doesn't open that. That'll take me back up into the vents, which is not where I want to go. Or is it? Yep, okay. Elevator. I'm gonna... See if there's anything on the second basement. We haven't been there yet. Or no, we have been there. That was how I got into the... Okay. Or was it? Oh, right. X is... There we go. I'm getting... I have to get used to the fact this uses, like, the... the like, Japanese-style PS1 button layout. Wait a minute. I'm gonna... no. No. Oh. Oh. Uh, I'm gonna flub the buttons a bit. I'm getting used to... Psycho Mantis has the power to read people's minds. He got the DARPA chief's detonation code. Okay. Hurry up or he'll get Baker's code, too. That's right. If the terrorists get Baker's code, they'll be able to launch that nuke anytime they want. Yeah, they'll use Metal Gear to do it. Colonel, did you know they were conducting a military exercise here using Metal Gear? I didn't know. Really? Snake, you've got to understand. I'm just the middleman in this operation. Anyway, hurry up and get to the second floor basement. Second you've floor got basement. To the arms tech president before the terrorists find out his code. Okay, so it is that no. God, uh... 
I hate how like some PS1 games use one layout and some use the other. It's really like jarring to switch back and forth. Is this it? Oh, there's no way for me to know because I don't have explosives yet, but I think that is it. it said they cemented over the entrance. Or so com bullets, okay. should look slightly different. Look at the walls carefully in first-person view mode. Try to find the walls that have a different pattern. Did you try hitting the wall? Maybe it'll sound different, too. You'll need some kind of explosive to destroy the wall, like C4 or something. Take a good look around the armory. Okay, so there is explosives somewhere. Okay. There's a wall there. Okay, so I've identified that. I just need to find where that C4 is. Did I miss it in here? Nope, oh, nope, that's a game over. I thought maybe there's a second floor under uh, an additional floor. That that's a fuck up. Okay. Hmm. So okay, let me get that let me get those uh bullets again. Because that was stupid on my part. Thought maybe there's like a lower level, but no, there's just death. Thankfully it only spawned me that far back, so that's fine. Let's 
see here. What floor is the armory on? Is that on the f basement floor? Is it on the first floor? Like, hmm. Because I know I need C4. I know it's at the armory. Where is it? Okay, so it, the game's really railroading me to the second floor basement, but I couldn't find the C4 it was telling me to get. So, like, hmm. Submitted over should look slightly different. Okay. You have sixteen thousand points. Should look okay. So the game's not doing me any favors here. It sucks. I know I've been in here, but like, what am I missing? <sighs> yeah, so I have the SOCOM and I have the chaff grenades, but I need C4 and I don't know where to get C4. So I know that bombable walls are there, and there. <sighs> Wait, this is the armory. So if this is the armory, where's the... Oh, wait, wait, wait. Do I need to have the card enabled? Okay. There, yeah, okay. I actually need to have the card equipped to open the doors. It's not automatic. I can use my brain sometimes. Digibento's one brain cell finally came in handy. So, there's grenades. Just used to modern games, I guess. I'm like, oh, well, I have the key card. I should be able to do the thing. But no, it's not that simple. Okay, got that one. Yeah. Emery, uh, I think I need the brain cell. I'm the one streaming right now. C4, SOCOM bullets. Okay. Looking for more bombable walls.
What, what's awesome? Confused. Oh, C4. There we go. You're jamming my, uh, my radar. Okay. That's, that's fine. That's, oh. Okay, well that's all the C4, so... Uh-oh. Am I too late? Have I not saved? I hope it'll be- I hope I won't need to redo all of that, because I haven't saved. He's alive. You're the arms tech president, Kenneth Baker, right? Don't worry, I'm here to save you. No, no, don't touch it! C4. This fight. Right. Touch that wire, and the C4 will blow up along with the old man. So you're the one that the boss keeps talking about. And you? Special Operations Foxhound. Revolver Ocelot. I've been waiting for you, Solid Snake. Now we'll see if the man can live up to the legend. This is the greatest handgun ever made. The Colt's single action army. Six bullets, more than enough to kill anything that moves. Now I'll show you why they call me... Revolver. I remember I remember this fight giving me some trouble as a kid. Hiding won't help you. I understand the bullets you see. I make them go where I want. I love to reload during a battle. There's nothing like a human to slam a long silver bullet into a well greased chain. All right, I'm alive. Let's go. I'm trying to get him, but I... Okay, I'm- I'm- I'm out, but he should have dropped bullets. Drops bullets when he- nope. Am I- so I am out. Yikes.
Come on. Drop some bullets for me to use. Uh, Minty redeemed imposter check. Thank you. I am actually sitting with good posture, so... Okay, let's see if... Oh, and I'm dead. I can't put my inventory when he's talking. That's a pain. I think I... I okay, I know what to do. I think I know what to do. Do I have any C4? Oh, it kicked me all the way back here. Well, that's fine. Before I go further, I think I'm going to use that uh, C4, like, on the one section of the wall that I didn't, like, go through. Thank you, redeemed a stretch. Thank you. See what's this way. Uh, okay. That was not entirely worth it. That shit. Okay. So, that's not worth it. Wait, no. Wait a minute. I know what I can do with that. I just need to, like, be very careful getting through there. And, uh, Emery redeemed a drink water. Thank you. Thank you, Emery. So, let's try that again. Because I think I know what I want to do with that C4. I just... Actually, let me, uh... Mei Ling, Mei Ling, Mei Ling, Mei Ling. I think you can't use your radar. Save. Be careful, Snake. Okay. Okay. Okay, got it. I'm gonna save again. Radar in that area. Yeah, I, I heard that. Save. Be careful, Snake. Okay. <laughs> I'm gonna actually. I wonder if. I wonder if. Okay. I make him go where I want. Okay, yeah. I love to reload doing a battle. There's nothing like the feeling of slamming an arm or silver bullet into a well reached chamber. All right. Alive. Let's go. Okay, so I can't set off C4 in here at all. Okay. I wonder if I can use stun grenades, though. Okay, so I can't set off C4 in there at all. Okay. Do I still have the uh, C4, though? Uh, 
Yes, I do. Yeah, I remember that area was very much a pain. Oh. Oh, but it resealed the... Okay. So it didn't actually reload my save, did it? That's fine. I'll just... What? Okay. Okay. Okay, I'm getting him. I've got him on the ropes. Don't you want to settle this? <laughs> I'm out. Shit. Let's see here. What do I got? Okay, grit. There we go. Bullets. set off any explosives? I don't have any bullets, so I guess this is all I have. Wait a minute. Nope. Can't set off any explosives. That sucks. Okay, so I need to be very conservative with my ammo, because I only get a little bit. Okay, so no explosives at all or the C4 goes off, and I need to be very conservative with my ammunition. I keep, like, blowing it. Okay, so... One shot, he goes down. If I mash, I just blow through all my ammo. Okay. Alright, PCV.
so. I won't help you. I understand the bullets you see. I make them go where I want. Okay. I love to be Got him. Okay, so alive. Let's go. Shit. You better hurry up. The old man's not gonna last too long. Don't you want to settle this? Okay. I've got him though, I'm getting him. Okay. Okay, I'm getting him. Pick up these. Almost got him. Come on. Got him. You're pretty good. Just what I'd expect from the man with the same code as the boss. It's been a long time since I had such a good fight. But I'm just getting warmed up. What? My hand! <laughs> Super Game Day Beep Boop right. Beep Boop you were lucky. We'll meet again. Who are you? I like you. I have no name. That that exoskeleton. Can you talk? Who are you? I'm not one of them. The DARPA chief told me he gave them his detonation code. What about yours? Oh, I get it. Jim sent you. You're, you're from the Pentagon. Answer my question. What about your code? There's no time. I... talked. What? Now the terrorists have both codes and can launch any time. It's not like I didn't fight. I managed to resist Psycho Mantis's mind probe. He couldn't read you? How'd you do it? Surgical implants in my brain. Surgical implants? Kind of like a psychic insulation. Everyone who knows these top secret codes has it. Even the DARPA chief? Of course. But the DARPA chief said Mantis got his code by reading his mind. 
Are you sure you heard him right? Yeah, I'm sure. In that case, how did they get your code? I never had any training on how to resist torture. <coughs> it looks like he had some fun with you, all right. Oh, he's not human. I tell you, he loved every second of it. What happened to your arm? He broke it. Looks like you're more than even now. His was sliced off. Ha, huh. you're a funny man. So the DARPA chief, is he okay? Dead. What? I can't be. You know, that's not what you promised, Jim. Now you want to shut me up? Oh. Calm down. What's wrong with you? I just told you I was here to save you. Uh, I didn't kill the DARPA chief. Uh, 210 Biohazard, thank you for the follow. Oh, don't be a fool. Anyway, the terrorists have both codes now. Those boys are totally insane. They wouldn't hesitate to launch. I agree, but what do they really want? Oh, who knows? Maybe they're like us in the arms industry, always looking forward to the next good war. Well, I'm not gonna let these maniacs start a war today. You still have- Uh, thank you. Uh... The uh, the artist who work on my overlay uh, is uh, Rockwell Light. Uh, their Twitter is linked in my uh, panels. You should check them out. Uh, they're really good. Woman, who? A soldier that was thrown in prison along with me. A female soldier. It must be. She said she had just joined up as a new recruit. They threw her in prison because she refused to take part in the rebellion. A new recruit? Could that be the colonel's niece? I gave her the key. Looks like she managed to break out of here, though. I hope she's okay. I'm sure she is. She's green, but as tough as they come. But how did you know she escaped? I was in contact with her by Codec. Until I was tied up here, that is. Codec? Yes, she stole it from the guard. If she still has it, you should be able to contact her. I'm sure she still has it. What frequency was she at? Oh, yeah. Let me tell you, it's... Oh... Sorry, I forgot. Damn! Oh, that's right. It should be on the back of the CD case. Try to contact her. I'll contact her right away. But tell me, if this doesn't work, is there some other way to prevent the missile launch? You need to find Hal Emmerich, one of my employees. Who's that? The team leader of the Metal Gear Rex project. A genius in engineering. But a little bit of an oddball. If there's anyone who can figure out... Yeah, so, uh, 210 Biohazard, uh, what's up? Like, uh, thanks for stopping in, like... You'll have to destroy it. Emmerich knows how to destroy Metal Gear. Where is this Emmerich? Like, uh, you, you find me in the tag, or, like, you find on Twitter, like... You know, like, just, what's up? I understand, but why Metal Gear? The nuclear age ended with the turn of the millennium. Oh, you're wrong. The threat of nuclear war isn't gone. In fact, it's greater than it's ever been. The amount of spent nuclear fuel and plutonium is increasing even today. Listen, have you ever seen a warehouse full of nuclear material? No. Drums and drums of nuclear waste stacked this high, as far as you can see. Because there's still no real way to dispose of the stuff. So they just close the lid and try to pretend like it'll go away? Uh, essentially, yes. And they're not even doing a good job of storing it. Many of the drums are corroded, with nuclear waste seeping out of them. Unbelievable. Not only that, but several pounds of muff are reported every year. Muff? It stands for material unaccounted for. It proves that there's a large and well-organized black market in nuclear materials. Furthermore, since the end of the Cold War, Russian nuclear engineers in particular are out of work with no way to turn. In other words, there's plenty of available nuclear material and scientists for making a bomb. We live in an age when any small country can have a nuclear weapons program. What about the other superpowers? Uh, Russia and China still maintain a significant nuclear presence. Complete nuclear disarmament is an impossibility. To maintain our own policy of deterrence, we need a weapon of overwhelming power. You mean Metal Gear. Yes. You know our industry suffered quite a blow as a result of the cuts in military budgets due to this so-called peace 
I remember hearing a lot about mergers and takeovers among the big weapons makers. Yes, and after my company lost their bid to produce the Air Force's next line of fighter jet, the Metal Gear system was our last ace in the hole. That's why we pushed to have Metal Gear developed as a black project. Black project? Secret projects paid for by the Pentagon's black budget. You can avoid a lot of red tape and get a great lead time on your weapons production. And no one can bother you. Not even those bleeding heart liberals on the Military Oversight Committee. Bribes. I prefer to think of it as good business. Anyway, Metal Gear was going to be formally adopted after the results of this exercise were analyzed. I don't give a crap about you and your company. Yes, that's about what I'd expect from a grunt like you. Here, th this is what you came for, right? What's that? An optical disc. It's all here. The main hard drive was destroyed by gunfire. This is the only remaining copy of the data. What kind of data? All the data collected from this exercise. Don't play dumb. I know you were sent to get this. I hid it from that sadistic maniac while he was torturing me. They don't know this disc exists. Make sure you report this to Jim. To your boss. I'll give you my card too. It'll open up all security level two doors. Can you walk? No. No, you go on without me. They got my password. They don't want anything else from me. I have one more question. Who or what was that ninja thing? It looked like you knew something. That ninja? That was Foxhound's dark little secret. Dark little secret? An experimental genome soldier. <coughs> you know him? You should ask Dr. Naomi Hunter from Foxhound. She knows better than I. Naomi? You've got to stop them. If it goes public, my company and I are, are finished. What? Doesn't Metal Gear use currently existing technology? Metal Gear itself does, but... And... What? There's, there's an extra heart attack. So, they, they actually went and did it. What are you talking about? They, they, they're just using you for... <sighs> what the hell? Now he's dead, too. I have no idea. Don't lie to me. It looked like another heart attack, but... Some kind of poison? Well, there are lots of drugs that can cause a heart attack in large doses. For example, potassium chloride or dioxides, but we won't be able to tell without doing an autopsy. Damn! Snake, I want you and Meryl to work together. Can I trust her? More than you can trust me. Get in contact with her. Snake, there's a lot of electrical interference coming from there. It should be okay if you do burst transmission like us, but normal transmission is probably impossible. Try moving away from that area. Snake, get a hold of yourself. Naomi, what the hell was that ninja thing? A member of Foxhound? No. Are you sure? Yes, we have no one like that in our unit. Is that right? Snake, I'm counting on you. Now, uh, with that cutscene over, uh, actually, firstly, I need to get the game case to get the codec number off of, and secondly, I need to use the restroom, so, uh, I'm, uh, kick us over the BRB scene, uh, give me a second here.
Okay, I'm back. So, uh... Gonna be getting back in the game. I've got the, uh, codec, the codec code, and, uh, yeah. Thanks for your patience. Sorry to cut the music short without a fade out. It's hard to fade out a YouTube video. Let's see here. No, no, no. Oh, d ah, dang it. I hit the wrong button. There we go. No response. Did I do it wrong? Is it 141.15? I'm going to go get the, uh, the box just to double check that. I know I transcended the RV. No, it's 140.15. Maybe I have to go out of the room. I have the box just in case. I don't understand uh, why that wouldn't work unless I have to, like, actually leave this room, though. Oh, alright, Minty. See you when you get back. Oh, it's because they're jamming the signals, isn't it? I get that C4. That was, uh, a trap. Dang it. Shit, 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 Nope. Okay. And I'm dead. Okay. Well. Ah. That sucked. fine now. Okay, so. I wonder if I can, like, crawl through. It's like, I can equip the sm the cigarettes. Hmm. Okay, let's try that again. Yep, okay. Okay. I'm good at videos game. Let's see, is there anything in here? No, I've already been there. That ah shit 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 shit. Okay, good. That guy's going that way, so I can just... That's... Oh, shit. Okay. Okay. There we Who go. Are you? I was really impressed with the way you busted yourself out of there. The one from the prison? You're the colonel's niece, Meryl, right? No, it's not him. Just exactly who are you? I'm the fool that your uncle sent all alone into the middle of this whole mess. 
You came by yourself? You think you're some kind of one-man army? I don't need lectures. You're just like your uncle, you know? How do you know my uncle? We go way back. What's your name? My name's not important. Aha. Uh -huh. Could you be Snake? Are you Solid Snake? That's what some people call me. The legendary Solid Snake? You? Sorry about before. I wasn't sure if you were one of the good guys. But I knew you were. How? It's your eyes. My eyes? They're not soldiers' eyes. And they're rookies' eyes, right? No. They're beautiful, compassionate eyes. How oh, just what I'd expect from the legendary Solid Snake. You trying to sweep me off my feet? Don't worry. You'll land back on them once you meet me. The reality is no match for the legend, I'm afraid. Oh, I don't believe that. Why did you look so surprised when you saw my face? Because you look just like him. You mean the terrorist leader, Liquid Snake? Yeah. You know him? You're not brothers, are you? I have no family. So what's the deal, then? Who knows? Why don't you ask him? But first, I want some information. You were involved in this exercise from the beginning. What exactly happened here? I'm sorry. I was captured along with President Baker right after the terrorist attack. That's okay. But what is this place? I don't think it's just a nuclear weapons disposal facility. Boy, oh boy, it's just like them. Nobody told you anything, did they? Okay. You see, this place isn't really for disposing nuclear weapons. This base is owned and operated by a dummy corporation of arms tech. This is a civilian base? Right. For the development of Metal Gear. Colonel. Foxhound and the Next Generation Special Forces were called here for the test launching of a dummy nuclear warhead. Why Foxhound? Because they're a special ops group used to handling top secret missions. They figured they could help keep it all hush-hush. But we must have fired nuclear warheads before. Why just this time? I heard it was because this was to be a final test before the formal adoption of the Metal Gear program. Well, that's what I heard, anyway. Uh, sounds kind of fishy. So what do you think the terrorists want? Mm, sorry. I'm not sure. I was captured with President Baker right after the revolt started. Oh, yeah. That's when he gave you the detonation code override keys, right? That's right. Amazing you were able to keep him hidden from the guards. Well, women have more hiding places than men. Anyway, you met Baker, huh? How's he holding up? He's dead. What? Heart attack. Same as the DARPA chief. The chief died from a heart attack too? Yeah. Was either of them sick or anything? No, not that I heard of. Well, I don't believe in coincidences. Something funny's going on. Hmm, sounds like it. But I have no idea what. Me neither. Yet. Do you know the person who designed Metal Gear? You mean Dr. Emmerich? Yes. Is he still alive? Probably. He should be in the research lab in the second floor basement of the nuclear warhead storage building to the north. Second floor basement? Yeah, that's where his lab is. I think they're forcing him to work on the nuclear launching program. So they'll need him alive until that's done anyway. Then we better do something before he finishes. You're right. In case we can't override the detonation code in time, I need to ask him how to destroy Metal Gear. You plan to take that thing on by yourself, Snake? It won't be the first time. Oh. What's the best way to get to the building where the doctor is being held? There's a cargo door on the first floor of this building that leads to the north. What's the security level of the door there? Five. But it's okay. I've got a level five card. Well, I've got to go save the doctor. You should go. I'm going with you. No way. You're still too green. I want you to hide somewhere. I'm not green. Oh, yes, you are. You pause for just one second in front of your enemy and it's all over. Good luck doesn't last forever. I don't know what happened. I just couldn't pull the trigger right away. I never had any problems in training. But when I thought about my bullets tearing through those soldiers' bodies, I, I hesitated. Shooting at targets and shooting at living, breathing people are different. Ever since I was a little girl, I always dreamed about being a soldier. Every day of my life, I've trained my mind and body for the one day when I could finally see some real action. And now... So what now? You want to quit? I can't quit. I can't allow myself to quit now. Listen, Meryl. Everybody feels sick the first time they kill someone. 
Unfortunately, killing is one of those things that gets easier the more you do it. In a war, all of mankind's worst emotions, worst traits come out. It's easy to forget what a sin is in the middle of a battlefield. But this isn't a war. It's a terrorist action. You're just a little jumpy from the combat high. The adrenaline in your bloodstream is starting to thin out. Just take it easy. But I learned all about combat high at the academy. We'll talk about it later. For now, just think about keeping yourself alive. If I get out of here alive, I'll think about that other stuff. Okay. Let me try to say this another way. Stay the hell out of my way. <laughs> You're a real bastard. Just like my uncle said. Huh. I told you. The real me is no match for the legend. <laughs> it looks like you were right. <laughs> <laughs> okay, Snake. I'll be a good girl. We'll link up after I grab the doctor. Then we'll take care of the detonation code override. Gotcha. But listen, I know this area better than you. Call me if you have any questions. Be careful, okay? After I open up the cargo door, I'll contact you. Okay, so now we know what we need to be doing. It's a building to the north, and I want to go to the basement in that building. I'm pretty sure is what was said. Snake, I unlocked the cargo door for you. Thanks. Where are you? Where I can see ya. Don't move around too much. Don't worry. I'm disguised in this enemy uniform. You won't be for long with the way you walk. What does that mean? Uh, nothing. Listen, Snake. The cargo door is like an airlock. It's equipped with infrared sensors. Be careful. If an intruder is sensed, gas is released. Gas? Okay, so we'll meet at the nuclear warhead storage building. Wait, you said you'd stay put and be a good girl. I changed my mind. Don't get careless. That's when things always turn sour. Sorry, but this is the only way I can figure out whether or not I'm cut out to be a soldier. I gotta get my hands dirty. These guys are professionals. You're gonna get yourself killed. See you there. Jesus Christ. Just... The flippancy of going, okay, I'll be a good girl, and then less than a minute later, oh, never mind, I changed my mind. Meryl needs some, like, some chill. Like, actually. Like, Meryl needs to chill. Give me a second. Be careful, Snake. That airlock is set with infrared sensors. You probably can't see them with your naked eyes, but there are infrared beams coming out of that wall. Touch any one of them, and the doors will seal off, and the place will be flooded with poison gas. Somehow, you've got to get through without setting off those sensors. Yeah, I, uh, I do remember how to do that, so that's fine. scandal never mind about that you're not using burst transmission are you nearby listen there's a tank in front of your position waiting to ambush you who are you anyway one of your fans oh, oops Ouch. and literally i get shot oh it's it was a mine that's what okay
Yep. Okay. Mind detector. Uh, Riv. The cigarettes let me see the infrared beams, so I was able to avoid them. You saw me use that earlier, too. The fact I can smoke, uh, lets me see the infrared beams. Okay, I don't need to hear this again. Uh, nope, damn it. Okay, so what am I supposed to do if he just, like, eats me, like, immediately? Snake. Hmm. Snake. Snake. <sighs> okay, so I'm gonna get the deep throat call again. I get through it. Hmm. Can I go this way? I didn't mean to call again, I meant to back out. That. Wait a minute. Calf grenade? Okay, so that doesn't do shit. I'm out of chaff grenades. Okay, that's not good. And 
and if I get run over. Fucking hell. Okay. Okay. Doing good, though. What? Oh, I don't have the ration yet. I just ignore it? Will I be able to, like, just start the battle? No, okay. Oh, yeah, no, yeah, okay. Okay, so it still makes me do it. I think you might be able to fool the tanks electric. Okay, that's fine. That's what I was doing. Okay, got it. as you said. In battle, he is as if possessed by a demon, much like you. I would expect no less. Vince, you redeemed your drink, water. I will kill you. So, General Ivan, I hear he took your hand as well as your dignity. Watch your tongue, shaman. In the language of the Sioux people, Sioux means snake. It is known as an animal to be feared. Snake is mine now. When I meet him next, I'll take special care of him. Not yet. Don't kill him yet. He and I will meet again in battle. Same prediction as always? Yes. The raven on my head. It thirsts for his blood. What can I do for you, Snake?
Oh, okay, I crawl through. Be careful. You absolutely must not use weapons in that area. I've already programmed the nanomachine so that he won't be able to, Colonel. What? What are you talking about? Have you forgotten? That's where they keep the nuclear warheads. Don't you see them? Yeah, there's lots of boxes piled up here, but... Are they all warheads? Yes, they're all dismantled warheads. They just leave them here? It's like President Baker said. Totally careless. They're working on a limited budget. They try to put on a pretty face for the media, but this is the grim reality of it. Nastasha knows lots more about it than I do. Her frequency is 141.52. All of the warheads in those boxes have had their detonation mechanisms removed, so there's no fear of them exploding. But if the warheads are broken, they might leak plutonium, and that would be a serious problem. Snake, never use your weapon on that floor. Is said or one four one dot did they say eight two? Oh whoops. Okay, which frequency did they say? I'm gonna Google that because I completely missed that. One four one dot five two, okay. Nastasha Romanenko, a pleasure to work with you, Solid Snake. You're the nuclear specialist that the Colonel mentioned? That's me. You can ask me anything about nukes that you want. I am also a military analyst, so I have an extensive knowledge of weapon systems as well. They asked me to participate in this operation as a supervisor from the Nuclear Emergency Search Team. I was happy to accept. We must not allow terrorists to get their hands on nuclear weapons of any kind. I hope I can help you to stop them. You're a tough lady. Those terrorists are serious about launching a nuclear weapon? The world cannot stand by idly and allow that to happen, and neither can I. Unfortunately, all I can do from here is provide you with information. Hopefully that'll be enough. Another soldier here wouldn't make a difference anyway. It's good to work with you, Nastasha. Same here, Snake. Oh, whoops. I did not mean to do that. People who have been through war and survived develop a kind of sixth sense to warn them of danger. Trust your instincts as a soldier, as a gamer. As a gamer. Oh my god. That's... Horrible. Trust my instincts as a gamer. Rise up, gamers. Oh shit. Well, I'm fucked. They started flooding the room with some sort of gas. Okay, I need to be... Okay. That sucked. Okay, that'll get her to show up on my uh, codec menu.
I'm not going to risk it for those bullets. That doesn't seem worth it. Okay, that's not good, that's not good, that's not good. And I'm dead. Okay. Jesus, that scared the shit out of me. I was not expecting. Fuck. I did all that and fuck. Let's try that again. That got me though, that got me bad. Oof. Actually got me. Like, ju dead ass. That jump scared me. I was not expecting that. Oh shit! And I'm gonna die because I just got saw by that guy, and it's my oxygen's gonna run out. And yep, yep. Okay. Let's try that again. I don't understand why they're shooting guns when I'm not allowed to shoot guns in there. the camera. Okay. I'm gonna die. I'm gonna die. That's fine. Okay. Need to play it safe. I, I was playing it safe before, and this time now I'm just consistently fucking up. Let's see if I can uh, take that from the top. Take that from the top. How am I supposed to get past that? Do I go? Oh, okay, I know what I know what to do. I know what to do. I know what to do. Do what I did before. Sneak over to the right. Wait for that guy to go, and then go back. Just that guy's positioned in a really shitty place. It's like immediately, if you don't already know he's there, you just get ganked. That's actually super rough.
Okay. That guy's coming that way. He's gonna turn. Walk past me. Okay. No. It's looking somewhere. Okay. Okay, good. Okay. Okay. <laughs> Find Hal Emmerich. So that is the only door, okay. Just freak me out because there's a hissing sound. Oh. Northwest wall. But how? I can't reach it. Use a remote controlled missile. Who are you? Just call me Deep Throat. Deep Throat? The informant from the Watergate scandal? Oh, because I skipped right. over. Okay. You're not using burst transmission. Are you nearby? Who are you anyway? One of your fans. Okay, so... Right, well, how am I supposed to use a missile if I don't have a missile launcher? Yeah, okay, yeah, okay, so I can't do that at all. So what am I supposed to do then? Like, where do I get the missile launcher from if I need to use a missile? I guess on another floor? Oh, and I still need to... Okay. Because I died, right? Oh, whoops. Okay, blah, 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 blah. Colonel, I got a codec call from someone outside this operation. I know. We were monitoring the call. Mei-Ling knows everything about the communication system, so let me have her explain it to you. Well, if somebody knows your frequency, they can call you. But the question is, how did he learn it? It's top-secret information. 
So you mean someone leaked the information? That's the only explanation I can think of. Mei Ling, do you know where nice. that transmission originated from? I'm sorry. The radio waves Chicken were fries. That sounds but good. I'm sure near you, somewhere on the base. For the time being, let's trust what Deep Throat told us. Use a remote controlled missile to destroy the switchboard in the northwest section of the Warhead Storage Building's second floor basement. Make sure your remote controlled missile doesn't get shot down by those gun cameras. How do I get a remote controlled fucking missile? Could you tell me? For the time being, let's trust what Deep Throat told. Okay. Yeah, but from where? Fam. I don't just like have remote control missiles growing out of my ass. I guess I can try going to the first floor basement. Uh, Minty, I think the question is why does Max from Ben 10 sound like, uh, Colonel Campbell? Not the other way around. Let's see here. For the time being, let's okay, okay, so it's not gonna railroad me into uh, go- okay. do anything there. Shit. Shit, 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 shit. And I'm dead. Okay. That's fine. Let's see where it'll load me in. Okay, this floor. So that's fine. I wonder if the remote... Missile. Hmm. Remote missile launcher might be on the first floor. It might be that box I was like super hesitant to try and get. I thought it would I thought it would work like those uh gun cameras where it doesn't see me if I'm crouching. Fucking hell. I am not doing good at this.
just a so calm. Fuck, those are just so calm bullets. Chaff grenades. So where's the missile launcher if it's not those? Because I don't have a remote missile launcher. I don't want to be, like, stuck here, but I don't want to, like, interrupt stream to check a guide. Hmm. Wait a minute. Can I... Okay, so I can't... There's nothing that way. Yeah, Minty, uh, it, I can easily look it up myself, but I just would feel really kind of shitty doing that. Like, hmm. Like, so, like, if you want to look it up while I'm trying to figure it out, like, be my guest. Like, that would be really appreciated. Okay, so I can't break the window. Hmm. Uh, this is the uh, nuclear storage building, uh, second floor basement, and we're trying to find uh, Otakon, uh, Hal Amarek. I thought it'd be easier if I typed it. <laughs> so like...
Is it in the truck? Thought I looked in the truck, but I'll look again. You know, I'll look. I'll look. It's fine. No, you're good, don't worry. Okay, okay. So I thought I'd look there, but uh, no, it's on the first floor basement. I thought I looked there, but I guess I didn't. No, that that music was oh shit. Well, I'm gonna die. No, that the music I put on was just to like so there'd be something for people to listen to. It was the intro from Police Knots. I used that as BRB music earlier. Yeah, cause like I know Metal Gear Solid, you know I figure Police Knots, it sort of fits the theme. Because I didn't know how long it would take, so I figured I'd put on, like, some, uh, some, like, music just in case I was looking for a while. So, southeast, okay. Okay, none of those. Okay. Got it. Uh, see about uh, destroying that electrical panel.
Dang it, okay. Let's see. Dang it, I missed it. It's close. I'm- oh, I'm dying, I'm dying, I'm dying. Okay. That didn't work, but I was close, okay. Snake. Let's try that again. Snake. Snake. Let's see here. Let's try that again. Actually, let me get a ration popped, just in case that becomes a problem again. Let's see here. Dang it, okay, so I can't go over the table. Dang it! Okay, I'm gonna go out. Oxygen goes up. Oh, I need to... Let's see here. Missile goes... Noom. Noom. Dang it! Ah! So close. Yes! Okay. Got it. Wait a minute. There are doors. Okay, I have my card. Nice. Can't go on that one. Shit! Well... Okay, well, at least I know there's a gas mask. See, I hope I don't have to do the, the I hope I don't have to do the missile again. That would suck. No, I don't. Okay, good. That's good. That'll let me... That's one, two, three...
Okay. What the hell? Uh, what do I call it when a trans person does something? Uh, I don't know what. Oh shit. Well, something happened here. It looks like they were cut by some type of blade. A transaction. That's good. The fuck? That was, uh, concerning. He pissed himself. Stealth camouflage? Who are you? Where is my friend? What? What are you talking about? Oh, what next? Snake. You're that ninja. I've been waiting for you, Snake. Who are you? Neither enemy nor friend. I am back from a world where such words are meaningless. I've removed all obstacles. Now you and I will battle to the death. What do you want? I've waited a long time for this day. Now I want to enjoy the moment. What's with these guys? It's like one of my Japanese animes. I've come from another world to do battle with you. What is it, revenge? It is nothing so trivial. A fight to the death with you. Only in that can my soul find respect. I will kill you, or you will kill me. It makes no difference. No! Ah, fine. He can watch from inside there. I need that man. Keep your hands off him. Now, make me feel it. Make me feel alive again. Shit. That's... If I remember, I can't use guns for this fight. I'm dead. Oh, I should have had my uh, ration equipped. I'll ha I'll do that next time. Because rations pop automatically if you have them equipped. All right. And of course, it doesn't just start me right at the fight. It starts me back here. That's fine. Good. Now we can fight the warriors. Hey. 
hand to hand. It is the basis of all combat. Only a fool trusts his life to a weapon. Okay, I got this. I wonder. Uh, oh, shit. Okay. trying to throw it, it wouldn't let me. That's fine. That's fine. Oh, nice. Okay, so I can't get- th I can't use shaft grenades or, like, he slices me. Am I- am I pressing the wrong button for grenades? Am I- It's like if I th I think if I use chaff grenades that might work better. It's yeah okay. It's uh, that button. Okay. Now make me feel it. Make me feel alive again. I wasn't facing the right way or I would have gotten him.
Dang it. Okay. Dang it. Okay. I gotta be careful. Tell by the audio cues. Oh wait. Oh shit. What's this cell? Chaff grenade. Okay. Close to death. I am very close to death. I was so close. God damn it. Okay. I I do have it figured out. I just need to last the whole fight. Okay. Okay. And I don't need the chaff grenades either. So that should be fine. That should be fine. I just need to CGP grit. Uh, what's that? I'm not familiar. CGP Grey. Uh, you, could you maybe, like, tell me what that is? I think I've seen it before, I just didn't remember what it was. Uh, I should check that out. Dang it. Okay, he got me. Let me just try to run over here so I can get the ration. Dang it. Man, it's like a fucking bus. Dang it. Okay. Okay. Just need to be- Ah, fuck! Okay. I got this. I got this. Dang it! I- Right under him. Okay, that's fine. That- No, it's not fine. No, it's not fine. No, it's not fine. Shit. Ah, shit! <sighs> well, I'm gonna die. But... Well, we're just gonna keep going. We're gonna keep going. <sighs> Fuck. This cycle, specifically, keeps getting me really bad, and I don't understand why. Spinny kick. Ah, 
Dang it. Okay. I'm probably gonna need to redo this fight, but I'm getting it. Oh, wait a minute. Okay, now we're on to the uh, third phase with the, the camouflage. And uh, Benui redeemed a posture check. Thank you for the posture check. Okay. Let's see here. Where'd you go? Hurry up and catch me. And I'm dead. Well, we're making good headway at least. I was like I just need to try and preserve my health a bit more during that second segment. Don't beeline for that ration. I should, uh, I should get it once he, like, breaks the, uh, window so I can, like, get to it more easily without, like, getting boxed in. Okay, got that. Okay, got him. Hands are sweating. So calm bullets, that's fine. I want this ration. Okay. Oh shit. Okay, well that's fine, I got the rations. Oh shit, I I need to be careful about that drop move. Okay. Okay. Dang it. Okay. Mm. Okay. I think I'm doing a lot- I think I'm doing better. Not, I won't say a lot better, but I think I'm doing better. Dang it. Okay. Dang it. Okay. He's actually kind of getting me, but... Dang it, okay. That's my second ration pop. That's not good. Dang it. Shit. Okay. Dang it. There we go. Visibility. Okay, so this cycle I think was easier in terms of raw damage output, so that should be fine. I still have a whole ration, so that's fine. Need to keep the pressure on. Dang it! Oh, 
And now I'm not... I don't have a ration anymore. Fuck. Okay. Dang it. Okay. It's to my left. Dang it. <sighs> one more hit and I'm out. Yep. One more hit and I'm out. Fuck. Maybe if I try using the chaff grenades during that phase, but if I pull out the chaff grenades, will we pull out the sword? <sighs> I wish there's a way to, like, not have to, like, walk all the way back every time, honestly. Or at least to skip these, like, mid-fight cutscenes, because, like, they do drag. actually doing pretty good this time, but I need to get that ration when I get the chance. Oh, okay. I'm gonna make a mad dash for that ration. Got it. Got him. Okay. Yeah, come here. Dang it, okay. Okay. Keeping, keeping him along the wall here is helping. Yeah, because this is like restricting his range of movement. Okay, there we go. I think this is going to be it. I think this one's going to be it. Hurry up and catch me. Now this cycle. go. Okay. Oh. Okay. This is the fourth phase. Okay. Okay, can't damage him when he's like in the... Okay. 
That popped a ration, but that's fine. Okay. Get him to come over. Oh, okay, so I'll swing, he'll... Okay, I got this. This is- this could go either way. This could actually go either way. I'm actually, like, kind of tense. I got it? I got it? Oh, you're fucking joking. The explosion at the end Oh my god. Fuck. Fuck! That was fucking cheap! Ah. Also, thank- Thank you for the stretch. Okay. Let's see if I can get that again. That was cheap. That was fucking cheap. I just need to get him against the wall, and I can just really easily get him in a pattern. Okay. Okay, so I get- get to that. Get that ration. No, no, no. I don't want it. I... Okay. Let me try and bait you down here. Come on, come on. Fight me. Fight me. Okay. Okay, got it. Okay. Dang it. Okay, got it. Hey, there's a poster for police knots in the room, I just noticed that. That's good. That's good shit. have one ration left, but... Okay. This phase. This phase. I can do this. See if I can bait him down here again. Oh, 
shit. Okay. Okay, so I am on my last ration now, but I think I got it. Okay, fuck. Okay, no, this could go either way again. Fuck! Okay, 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 okay. We got it, though. We're getting- we're getting close. We're getting close. We're getting close. I almost had it that time. Hey, every time we get a little closer, you know? Yeah, no, the game over screen. And, like, they modernize it, like, for the newer games. And it, like, but it's, like, still the same basic screen that it was now, in this game. Make me feel it. Make me feel alive again. Let me just... Okay. It's Good. fine. Now we can fight as warriors. Hand to hand. It is the basis of all combat. Only a fool trusts his life to a weapon. Let's see if I I want to get that ration. Okay. Oh wait, right. I want to get him down here. Okay, okay, okay. Dang it. Okay, okay. Shit. That that long that long jump kick thing is really a a killer. Okay, okay. Okay. That's good, Snake. Hurry up and catch me. Oh, shit. Okay. Dang it. Okay, shit. Hurry up and catch me. Where is Okay. Okay. Very really close. I'm gonna lure him down here again.
Dang it. Okay. Oh, last ration. Shit. getting really annoyed at this. Like, actually, like, just gotta center, gotta focus. I understand the way that pattern works. It still is just an ass kicker. Oh my god. Yes, I did. Uh, Minty redeemed a drink water. Thank you, Minty. Wish I had gone into this with three rations plus the one in the corner. That would have been better. Because, like, I have just enough to get to the end. I don't seem to have enough, like, the way I'm currently playing, to get past that. Posture check. Thank you. Stealth camouflage? Who are you? Where is my <sighs> Center. What? What are you talking Center, about? just focus. Oh, what next? Just letting the cutscene play out. Give me a second to just like calm. You're that ninja. Just calm. I've been waiting for you, Snake. Who are you? Neither enemy nor friend. I am back from a world where such words are meaningless. I've removed all obstacles. Now you and I will battle to the death. What do you want? I've waited a long time. The, the desk? What, what's going on with my desk? Ah, shit. There we go. Okay. Okay. What's with these guys? It's like one of my Japanese animes. I've come from another world to do battle with you. What is it? Revenge? It is nothing so trivial as revenge. A fight to the death with you. Only in that can my soul find respect. I will kill you, or you will kill me. It makes no difference. No! Ah, fine. He can watch from inside there. I need that man. Keep your hands off him. Now, make me feel it. Make me feel alive again. That's good, Snake. Okay, so now I'll stop using the sword. Now, I grab the ration, bait him to the bottom. Somersault kick is a real killer. Shit, okay. He's just spamming that somersault kick and just eating my health bar. 
God damn. Shit. Okay. This is bad. This is bad. This is bad. Down to one ration already. That's good, Snake. Hurry up and catch me. I'm here, Snake. Dang it! Okay, last ration. God damn it. I really... I really want to be, like, in this cycle with one... in this... Dang it! Okay, no... Dang it. I really want to be in that last, uh, phase with two rations, I think. So I just really need to stretch that for that first ration out. Which is hard when he keeps spamming that somersault kick. At least I can get reliably to that phase now. Dang it. Shit. Okay. That's already pretty bad. Good. Now we can fight as warriors. Hand to hand. It is the basis of all combat. Only a fool trusts his life to a weapon. Dang it. Okay. Need to make that last. Dang it. That's shit. I really need to make that second ration, that first ration last. Dang it. Not good. Dang it. Okay. Okay. That's good, Snake. Hurry up and catch me. No. Okay. Okay. Dang it. 
Okay. Last ration. That's not what I want that's not what I wanted right now, but I think I can deal with it. Okay, I need to not mash until I've actually hit him. Dang it! Ah. wonder if I backtrack will I be able to find another ration. Yeah, I'm gonna I'm gonna do that actually. Shit! And immediately I walk right into the gun turret because I forget it's there. <sighs> I'm never gonna learn with this game. Jesus Christ. Shit, 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 shit. Okay. Yeah, okay. Uh, yeah, the gun turrets in there are, like, insane. How am I going? I don't think I'm supposed to go that way. Let me try backtracking out of the entire section. If I can find another ration, then I should be good. Just a toilet. Wait, what? So calm bullets. Nikita missiles. Okay, what that means though is that things do refill as I go from floor to floor. Because those are the same Nikita missiles that I picked up before. So if I go back to the first floor, will I be able to find another ration? Because I think there's a ration on the first floor.
It's a chaff grenade. Last bullets. Great. How far do I have to backtrack? I'm gonna have to... I I'm gonna have to go back to the other building, huh? Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. I think I know there's a ration. their ration up these stairs. If not, I do really have to backtrack. Is this a ration or was it something? Yes, it's a ration. Fuck yes. Fuck yes. Shit, 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 Okay, okay. At least I know where there's a ration. Will it give it to me, or will it have me go get it again? That's the question. Let's see here. Okay, it wants- it still has- wants me to go back and get it, but I know where it is. I know where it is. Yeah, we know the things. It's just a matter of putting it into practice. Okay. 
This time I should be able to do it. This time I should be able to do it. And worst comes to worst, I get another ration and uh, fill my health bar. So, like, I have a plan. But we should be good. Okay. Good. Now we can fight death warriors. Hand to hand. It is the basis of all combat. Only a fool trusts his life to a weapon. Dang it. Okay. I'm good, though. Shit, okay. Okay, now I need to go get that other ration. Because... That's the whole reason I did this. Dang it, okay, that's fine. Dang it. Okay. That's fine. It's fine. That's good, Snake. Hurry up and catch me. No, not that. Dang it! Okay. Okay, where are you? Hurry up and catch me. Okay. Yes, two, two rations on this uh, part of the fight. That's what I was hoping for.
Dang it, okay. I'm gonna fucking run. Oh, 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 I, do I need to like avoid? Oh, do I shoot him when he's doing that? What the fuck? What? what? What am I supposed to do there? I'm gonna look that up, actually, because, like, that is completely confusing. Use the FAMAS. Okay. Okay. Wait, wait. Okay, so that one I do use the gun. All right. But, like, I actually was able to get to the end again there, so... Okay, I got this. Yeah, I thought that was just the end of the fight, but no, I actually do have to use a weapon there. But this is fine. I was able to, like, rely, like, completely, like, reliably get to the end there. Ration, 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 ration. Dang it, wait, I he should have had he should have been stunned, I hit him. Oh he is really juggling me, shit. Shit. The fuck kind of pattern is this compared to the past fights? He's, like, really behaving differently now than he was before. Dang it. It's got me down to two or three already. Shit. That's really not what I would have wanted. want to be, but fine. 
Okay. Dang it. Okay. Fuck, 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 fuck. Okay. Come on, please. Got it. Got it. I felt that snake. Do you remember me now? Can't be. You were killed in Zanzibar. Well, the, they were able to, like, just barely have the rumble go, so the controller just sort of very faintly, like, wobbled. Gray that Fox. was rad. That ninja is Gray Fox. No doubt about it. Ridiculous. You of all people should know he died in Zanzibar. No. He should have died, but he didn't. What? It happened before I joined Foxhound's medical staff. They were using a soldier for their gene therapy experiments. I never heard that. It happened right after you retired. My predecessor, Dr. Clark, was in charge. Dr. Clark? Yes. He started the gene therapy project. And where is he now? He was killed in an explosion in his lab two years ago. So what about this soldier? Apparently, for their test subject, they decided to use the body of a soldier who was recovered after the fall of Zanzibar. And that was Gray Fox. But he was already dead. Yes. But they revived him. They fitted him with the prototype exoskeleton and kept him drugged for four years while they experimented on him like a plaything. Today's genome soldiers were born from those experiments. That's the sickest thing I ever heard. They used him to test all sorts of gene therapy techniques. Naomi, why didn't you tell us about this sooner? Because it's confidential information. Is that the only reason? Naomi, what happened to Gray Fox after that? The record says he died in the explosion. I see. But even if that ninja is Gray Fox, the question is, why? From what I could tell, he didn't know who he was. Are you saying that he's just a mindless robot? I'm not sure, but he seems intent on fighting me to the death. We'll meet again. I know it. So you'll fight again? Until you kill him? Huh. I'd rather not. But maybe that's what he wants. How long are you gonna stay in there? Huh? 
Are you one of them? No, I'm not. I always work alone. Alone? Are you an otaku too? Come on, get out. We can't stay here forever. Your uniform is different than theirs. You're the Metal Gear chief engineer. Finally now, fucking beat class. it. You know, I know I said I was going to run long today, but I heard about you from Merrill. I think after this cutscene, I'm going to save so and call it. Uh, I'm Sorry, already looking at who to raid. Something that I've got to do first. Uh, oh. well, I think I'm going to throw it over to. No. Huh. Are you hurt? You. So. I'm gonna throw this to the room. Uh, Orange is streaming Sonic Adventure 2, or uh, Pepper is streaming Crash 4. Uh, fucking, what's up? What, 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 what do you think? I, I could go either way. Yeah. What's Metal Gear really designed for? It's a mobile TMD. It's designed to shoot down nuclear missiles, only for defensive purposes, of course. Fire. I already know that Metal Gear is nothing but a nuclear-equipped walking deathmobile. Nuclear? W what are you talking about? The terrorists are planning to use Metal Gear to launch a nuclear missile. You telling me you didn't know? They're gonna put a dismantled warhead into Metal Gear's TMD missile module? Wrong. From the beginning, the purpose of this exercise was to test Metal Gear's nuclear launch capability using a dummy nuclear warhead. The terrorists are just continuing the work you started. No, you're wrong. I heard it directly from your boss, Baker. No. A nuclear missile on Rex? So you really didn't know? No. All the armament was built by a separate department, and the president personally supervised the final assembly of the main unit. President Baker? Yeah. I was never told exactly uh, I just flipped a coin and it I only know it's came up pepper so uh, I'm a laser and I'm, a rail gun. you know yeah I'm gonna throw it to pepper a rail gun you said just yeah. let's let this fl cutscene play out to fire bullets at extremely high velocities the technology was originally developed for the SDI system and, and later scrapped we were successful in miniaturizing it in a joint venture between arms tech and Rivermore National Labs the railgun is on Rex's right arm. Metal Gear's main function is to launch nuclear missiles. You sure you're not forgetting something? It's true that Metal Gear has a missile module on his back that can carry up to eight missiles, but are you saying it was originally meant to carry nuclear missiles? Yeah, but that's not all I think. If Metal Gear fired only standard nuclear missiles, then they should already have all the practical data they need. No. Could it be? Metal Gear's co-developer, Rivermore National Labs, was working on a new type of nuclear weapon. They were using Nova and NIF laser nuclear fusion testing equipment and supercomputers. So they developed a new type of nuclear weapon in a VR testing lab, huh? Yes, but you can't use virtual data on a battlefield. They would need actual launch data. These are some of the supercomputers. If you link these, you can test everything in a virtual environment. But it's all just theoretical. So this exercise was designed to test the real thing. What did our president do? If the terrorists launch that thing... <sighs> Damn. S -s Damn. I'm such a fool. It's all my fault. The truth is... My grandfather was part of the Manhattan Project. He suffered with the guilt for the rest of his life. And my father, he was born on August 6th, 1945. The day of the Hiroshima bomb. God's got a sense of humor, all right. Three generations of Emmerich men. We must have the curse of nuclear weapons written into our DNA. I 
I used to think that I could use science to help mankind. But the one that wound up getting used was me. Using science to help mankind. It's just in the movies. <laughs> That's enough crying. Pull yourself together. Where is Metal Gear? Where on this base are they keeping it? Rex is in the underground maintenance base. Where is that? North of the communications tower, but it's a long way there. The emergency override system for the detonation code is there too? Yeah, in the maintenance base control room. You'd better hurry. If they were planning a launch from the start, then their ballistic program is probably finished. And since they haven't called for me in a few hours, they must not need me. In other words, they must be ready to launch. Meryl's got the detonation code override keys. We'll link up with her. If we can't override the launch, we'll have to destroy Rex. Yeah, uh, Minty, uh, I'll show you the, way. the Metal Gear is like the nuclear walking ta tank. Like, even in the original Metal Gear for the MSX from the 80s, the name referred to the nu the walking nuclear tank that was like the final boss. my duty to destroy him. If you get a chance, try to escape. When the coast is clear, yeah, because uh, Metal Gear Solid actually is not the first game. There were two uh, Metal Gear games for the MSX computer in uh, Japan in the 80s. Keep me informed. You know this place well, don't you? Of course I do. And don't worry, I've got this. So, like, this game keeps calling back to uh, the MSX Metal Gear, talking about Zanzibar and Gray Fox, and that's all, like, callbacks. Bad leg and all. Good. But I want Meryl to watch after you, too. Meryl, the engineer's okay. That's a relief. I want you to look after him. Where are you now? Very close. There she is! Over there! <gasps> oh no! Damn, they've spotted me! <laughs> Meryl, what happened? Something's wrong. Did you hear something? Wasn't that some kind of music? What did she look like? She... she was wearing the same green uniform as the terrorists. A disguise? She had such a cute way of walking. She kind of wiggles her behind. You were really looking. Well, she's got a very cute behind. Way of walking, huh? If she's disguised as the enemy, you'll have to contact her when she's alone, huh? There's only one place where we can be sure she's by herself. Oh no. That? Don't be so dense. Here, use this security card. It's security level four. You're not in pain, are you? Huh? You feel okay? Nothing bothering you? What's wrong? Getting all friendly all of a sudden. No, nothing. I'm glad you're okay. You're strange. I'm a little nervous. Everyone else I've saved suddenly dies. You're bad luck. Forget it, doctor. Call me Otacon. Otacon? Fun fact, uh, yeah, Otacon is literally named for the convention. Yeah, Otacon is literally named for Otacon, the, the convention. They're still the best in the field of robotics. And Japanese cartoons played some part in that? They did. I didn't get into science to make nuclear weapons, you know. That's what all scientists say. I became a scientist because I wanted to make robots like the ones in the Japanese animes. Really, it's true. It just sounds like a childish excuse to me. You're right. We have to take responsibility. Science has always thrived on war. Greatest weapons of mass destruction were created by scientists who wanted to be famous. But that's all over now. I won't take part in murder anymore. Whatever. All I want from you is information. Sure. I know everything about this whole base. Ask me anything about Rex or about this place. Also, with this stealth camouflage, I can sneak in and out of the armory and mess hall. If you need ammo or rations, just tell me and I'll bring them to you. God. 
Th this cutscene just keeps on going. See you later. Okay, 141.12. I'm gonna call that just so it's saved before I save the game. Okay, and I think we're finally out of cutscene hell. storage building that you're in has one floor above ground and two floors below ground. Why don't you search there too? Okay, so now Otacon's on there. I'm gonna call Mei Ling. Snake, there's an old Chinese saying. A scholar who cherishes the love of comfort is not fit to be deemed a scholar. Einstein said it another way. He said that only a life lived for others is worth living. That's why I entered MIT instead of Princeton or Vassar like my friends. I wanted to do applied physics, not just a theoretical stuff. I wanted to make things for people. The Soliton radar system or the Codex system. I just wanted to make something that would be useful for people. Okay, Mei Ling. That it was the same for Dr. Emmerich, too. Ah. Uh. But he was used like a tool. He used to make a horrible killing machine. Maybe it would be better if engineers like us just stopped making things. I don't know. So, save, and, uh, yeah, uh, I already got the raid queued up, and, uh, let's throw things over to, uh, to Pepper. Uh, so, social, you know, uh, thanks for hanging out, you know, I, uh, I have a Twitter, follow me on Twitter, I got my Discord, join my Discord, you know, we all hang out, we talk about everything, Yu Yu Hakusho, uh, fucking like just like animal crossing whatever like we're all over the place it's a fun time uh watch my vods on youtube i've got a bit of a backlog of vods i need to put up but i'm gonna be taking care of that uh also uh uh i'm a member of the vtuber group digibento we have a group twitter uh there's a community discord i have eclipse youtube and i almost forgot i still haven't put anything up but I uh, have a TikTok that I'm going to be putting stuff up on at some point. Uh, so feel free to follow that. And uh, yeah, that's everything. And remember, Eureka! Now uh, let's uh, throw things over to Pepper. Secret VOD noises. Secret VOD noises. Ooh.